Okay guys, I'm uh, actually back on this boiler that we uh, installed last year. Got a bad circulator. Uh, so uh, I'm going to change it out right now. Got the new one in my hand. It is a Grunfus uh, UPS 43-100F. Uh, surprising that it actually went bad. I mean, these are usually pretty good circulators. Um, change it out right now everything else is running all the other zones this does the second floor in this building unfortunately I had to get the uh, when I took the pump off it's a nice shiny new insulation got all dirty oh so it's gonna basically set in here just like this you know like a pump like a circulator pump goes so I'm not gonna be able to video that while I'm doing it so I'll come back when I got it in thanks Okay, I got the pump in here, all bolted in. Here's our connections. Now these are nice because they uh, they press right in. Now this is stranded wire that they used here, the electricians used. So make sure you, when you put these in, if it's stranded, you restrip the connections so that they're straight on, so that you don't get a short between line and neutral here seen that before. In fact, I'm going to think I'm going to run my neutral up here. So it's away from the uh, away from the line side of the pump. Um, these are a three-speed pump also. So that's the three-speed spits. There's a little board here. Capacitor. So, pretty nice pumps. I'm sorry, surprised that this one failed. So I already labeled it. Pump one, second floor. So I haven't uh, filled it with water yet. That'll be our next uh, next thing here. We can open up. We're gonna test it for leaks here. Let's see if we got anything or not. Let's go over to this side so we can get some leverage on it here now. Okay. Let's see if we got any leaks on the supply side. See no water dripping on the supply side at all. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to bleed some air out of this thing. If I can do it, if I can get that Allen key out. So here's how you can bleed the air out of these. Okay. You can bleed the air out of the pump. So that it's not air bound. I don't know if you can hear the water or the air coming out there. There's the water. Boom. Okay, so that bleeds the pump so that it's primed. Alright. Let me open up. Open up our return side. See, I don't see any leaks. Check it one more time. Okay, we're getting water there, so that means the pump is primed. Once you're getting water in here, that means the pump is filled with water. So you know you're good to go there. Alright. So I'm going to kick it on. Actually, I'm going to put the uh, cover back on here. Milwaukee 11 to 1 screwdriver. Love this thing. Makes life here a lot easier for me. Okay. Now we're going to have it on. This was set at high speed. 
because it's feeding a bunch of uh, radiators and stuff up on the second floor. And it's also got a push all the way up to the second floor. Okay. So, let's turn it on here. P1. Oh, look at that. There we go. You can hear it running, pumping, circulating some water. Let's go over here and see. Uh, should be getting some hot water back on these lines. It won't be right away yet, but look at those floorboards. They're nasty. Okay, here we go. We hear the boiler kicking on, so it's pushing cold water. I just like to check this. Okay, no, there's no air. No, no, it's not air bombing. As long as you get water at that, uh, at that uh, relief right there, you know you're good to go. Okay, we'll let this run for a few minutes. And we start getting some hot water through this pump. And then we can uh, go upstairs and uh, check the radiators and make sure that it's... Uh... Now this is a locking bar. Let me see if I can shut the flash off here. 97%, now it's at 99, 100%. So, like I said, it's a nice little boiler. 140 degree water right now. Nice little system. All right, I'll be back with you. We're gonna show you the uh, display on this thing. Tells you what the flame current is. The boiler pumps on, There's no domestic hot water on this. Tells you how much, how much, and how long it can run. Pretty cool. Pretty nice boiler. Okay, we're starting to get warm water back in the return here. Couldn't take you guys upstairs, there's people up there, so didn't want to. Uh, Show that. Follow the directions. Also, when you put these things in. This is our outside air intake, nice and open. Little uh, unit heater here. Really doesn't need it up here, but we're kicking on. Nice little system. Got a little zone valve there that opens up. And start getting some heat out of it. Nice little setup. That's only for really when it's really, really cold. Okay guys, hope you liked like what I showed you here. Just a little one of my service calls or of the day. Warranty change out and a Grunfu circulator. Thanks for watching guys, have a good one.